All right, so let's get our data for walking in the negative direction. Although well, remember that we're starting on the positive side. So these numbers are going to, these positions are going to be positive, but we're walking in the negative direction. And we started our timer, in other words, time zero, when we were at 25 meters. All right, let's get our first mark. Here we go. Here is mark number one, positive number. Here's mark number two, We're on the positive side. Here's mark number three. Here's mark number four. Here's mark number five. Here's mark number six. Here's mark number seven. Here's mark number eight. Here's mark number nine. And here is mark number 10. Remember all of these positions are going to be positive. We're walking in the negative direction but we're still on the positive side of zero. For this set of data, we're gonna be starting uh, on the positive side of zero. We'll be walking in the negative direction. We'll be starting our timer at 25 meters, and we'll be dropping a mark every two seconds. The slow speed. Drop, 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 drop. So now we're going to read our data for walking in the negative direction, starting on the positive side of zero. We'll be starting at 20, we started the timer at 25 meters, when I was at 25 meters, and now we'll record the position of each mark, and these will all be positive positions. Here is, whoops, here is mark number one. That's after two seconds. Here is mark number two. Here's mark number three. Here's mark number four. Here's mark number five. So we're at 10 seconds. Here's mark number six. Mark number seven. Here's mark number eight. Here's mark number nine. And here's mark number 10.